kids 6th standard hello guys this is a continuation of the previous videos of lesson number 2 the living world if you have not watched the previous videos you can check the link in the description and watch it in those previous videos we have discussed about the characteristics of living things characteristics of non living things explanation of growth explanation of respiration and also the explanation of excretion and now in this video we are going to learn about the next characteristic that is responsiveness to stimuli and movement i will ask you a question have you ever observed the mimosa plant okay if you have not you can observe in this video that when you touch this mimosa plant the leaves of the mimosa plant gets closed this tells us that when we touch that it is giving us a response this also tells us that the mimosa plant is a sensitive plant when we touch that plant it responds to us by closing its leaves and now we are going to learn about this characteristic only that is responsiveness to stimuli and movement this mimosa plant responds to a stimuli that is responsiveness to stimuli and movement what is stimuli stimuli means an event that is occurring in our surroundings we will see this in detail the movement or the change that is taking place in a living thing in a time is their response to a stimulus an event that occurs in our surroundings is a stimulus in simple ways the movement or the change that is taking place in a living thing in a certain time which time when an event is occurring and when the living thing responds to that event it is called the response to a stimuli the ability of living things to respond to a stimulus is called their responsiveness to stimuli stimuli is the plural of stimulus responsiveness to stimuli is seen in every living things that is why responsiveness to stimuli is the characteristic of living things now i will give you some of the examples of this responsiveness to stimuli if you suddenly enter a cow shed the cows and buffaloes stand up begin to move one or two may even start moving these are all their movements a creeper A creeper planted in the courtyard leans towards a support. In this picture, we can see that a money plant is leaning towards a support. The support is the stick. A potted plant placed in a window grows towards sunlight. This is also one of the example of responsiveness to stimuli. In the next video, we will learn about the next characteristics of living things. So don't forget to watch the next video and also don't forget to like and subscribe my video. Thanks for watching.